Hi, I'm Dave with Dave Arbogast Conversion Van Sales. What I have behind me here today is a 2021 Chevrolet Express van. This is a long chassis van, it's gonna be a three quarter ton. Um, gonna have, I think it's, I think it said 16,000 and change in the odometer right now, so very low miles. Uh, you can see here, this one's a little bit different. That's why I've gotten the video of it. I really enjoy the ones that come in kind of different. Uh, it's got some of the options on it that y'all like, some of them that you, uh, not used to but anyway this one is without the ground effects you see on the side here it doesn't have any of the running boards doesn't have any of the rear bumper fascia cover either it just has the front one uh, with the fog lamps no step plate up front uh, it is a limited se with some a la carte options on it so this one obviously was ordered special it is a six passenger example meaning it has nothing but captain's chairs in it all the way back uh, black in color, as you can see, the windows have been tinted. It does have Vista Bay windows, does have electronic running boards, does have 20 inch wheels. It is a blackout package. Uh, does have the 6.6 .6 liter V8 in it. Uh, it's gonna be the last year that you can get a conversion with the V8, okay? At least for the GM line anyway. Um, I think I'm speaking for the other ones too, but uh, at any rate, uh, let's get started on it. Don't see much going wrong with it. Just has a different look to it. Uh, but if you look a little bit, like a little bit of cleaner lines, this may be, may be the one for you. Um, you see here, it does have the black wheels, 16,000 miles or so on the tires. Don't see any really body, stamp body damage. You can see the uh, electronic running boards there. It does have the lighted step plates as well. Single graphite color inside, two-tone door panels. You see the 16343 on the odometer right now. It does have steering wheel controls throughout. It does have the upgraded navigation with the touchscreen radio. There's your front heat and air controls. There's your switch bank for the rear. There's your rear air conditioning there. And again, on the dash, you're gonna have all your 12 volt power, your traction control, passenger side airbag on or off, your OnStar. This, this one's gonna have lane change to collision avoidance, which they don't have the buttons on uh, the 22s on up anymore. 110 volt, five volt, and 12 volt power there. Also your uh, trailer tow haul mode. Does have tilt wheel, of course. Uh, black leather, as you can see. Graphite two-tone on the door panels and headliner, carpet, all that sort of stuff. All right. Wear on. I don't think there's any damage on the inside at all. Does have a class three hitch with your seven and your four pin connections there. I did not notice a brake controller inside. GM does not include those. The wiring is included. However, the actual brake controller is not does have the blinds throughout on the inside does not have a sofa bed in the back you can hear the rear air running right now does have the uh 32 inch flat screen with surround sound no console in the center and an open hallway all the way up of course those four captain's chairs do swivel do quick release do adjust for leg room and do quick release and come out if you want to take them completely out of the van lots of storage room in the rear behind those captain's chairs of course, you do have the blinds on the inside. No power sofa bed. It does have your vacuum, vacuum, sorry, and your jack storage there with 12 volt power. Also, looks like it has a shore power hookup in case you're camping with it, which is probably what this van was used for. Blinds on every window. And there's your shore power hookup in case you want to camp and shut the van off and use the power. You can. Use the uh, campsite's power pole there. Again, it's a nice looking van, just doesn't have the uh, ground effects on it. And for some of those, some of you, I know that's a that's a positive. Right. Looks like her leather's in great shape. You don't have a center console in this van but you do have the DVD player and the game console hook up there in the sidewall. Oops, I hit a button, didn't I? Is that better? Still learning my phone thingy here, guys. See here, you got the captain's chairs. They're gonna be swivel, and to swivel them, you take this, it goes back. Of course, you're going to have the other two cabinet chairs there. They also swivel quick release and come out. Got a little bit of storage overhead. 
You do have your sunroof, mood lighting. And here's your game console hookup and DVD player. You have a lighted cup holders, your remotes for your TV. All right, get this one up posted. Do you guys have a suggestion on one of our vans that might be an inventory that I don't have a video on yet? Please feel free to send me that stock number and I'll look it up and get it done for you. All our inventory is at www.gmcconversionvans.com. Thanks for watching.